They was kind of, they was so, they was so nice. They were so spiritual, and they were just telling me their life story. Like, yeah, we want to do this YouTube. We want to take it so seriously. And so, you know, they was like, Aerie, you want to do a video? And I'm like, oh, my God. Like, like I don't know. Like, oh, my God. I'm like, y'all are so pretty, so nice. And we hugged, and they were so, like, they were so nice to me. And, like, we, we had a nice little time while they was here. And um, they had made the comment in a, in a live that, you know, and they were right. I had not kept contact with them. I haven't kept contact with them when they were here and when they were gone. But they... Are you cold? Hot? Cold? No, I'm like a... I'm like you. Come on. You think you're throwing off my... I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But with Gabby and Sierra, I liked their vibes when they were... Whatever y'all calling her because I'm looking at the comments and one is disrespectful two she did nothing wrong because she was right I did call her when she was I did call her when they landed into uh, Miami because of of course how it looked you know what I'm saying because I'm still a female I'm in my feelings because I'm like oh my god like dang I'm still getting like play like even after I keep trying to push this positive vibe out there but i i do not support people going after her telling her that she ugly coming after her as a person and what she believe in i do not do that it's us females we cannot let a male who cannot see can, is not nowhere to be found a male come for us and make us divide each other mm -hmm. like i told china i i don't i don't i'm not having no beef with no females because there is no beef because we supposed to keep supporting each other keep it going my phone about to die we supposed to keep this we supposed to keep it going and so i feel like as us as females i want to tell them that i apologize that my fan base is coming and being so rude to y'all in such like a oh wait i'm so sorry guys my phone's gonna die so sorry we don't want the phone to die now there we go there we go it's gonna be a little crooked just deal with it right now okay <laughs> wait i don't know how to fix it hold on Oh my god, this is difficult than what I thought. What we do for y'all. Right. We love y'all so much. This cut this can't do it. Who's up this? We just want the fun we just don't want the fun to die, y'all. I'm sorry. Look at these. Can you just sit in there? Okay. Because so I just Y'all, I just said yesterday, I'm not just talking to chocolate girls. I'm not just talking to uh, to just brown girls of any shade. I'm talking to every female out there that if you got a problem with somebody, you're supposed to fix it. Or if it looks some way, I called uh, Gabby, and yes, I admit it, because I, I don't do drama. I like to let y'all know. I called Gabby because I'm like, hey, like, are you with, are you with, like, Chris and Trey? Because that's how it looked, like. I'm seeing they live, you know what I'm saying? I see a little hand move. It looks like Trey hand. I'm like, I'm on investigator mode. I'm like, oh, she's gonna be around a bush and throw shit. Yeah, so I wasn't, you directly, like, and I'm getting all these DMs and messages like, oh wait, like they both in Miami, boom, 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 and I'm like, oh my god. So as a woman, I'm coming to another woman. I'm like, hey, and she kept it real with me. She said, no, I haven't been. And then we talked about everything, and she was like, I feel like you shouldn't have came, and you know, you had, you never check up on me, boom, boom, boom. And so I'm coming. And I want to apologize. No, I didn't keep in contact with you. When I hit Orlando, I did not. Uh, I did not hit you up when you was checking on me. I didn't. And when you had called, I seen the message. I'm like, oh my goodness. I did not do my part as a friend to make sure that you was good as you was checking on me. And I want to apologize for that because it's it's not fair. It's not fair. And especially because if you enjoying yourself in Miami right now, how it don't help that you got all these people coming at you. 
and they calling you a hoe, they calling you out your name and coming against your character as a woman. So I'm coming to you as another woman to tell you that I'm sorry. And I want to tell Team Ari and Team Carmen and Team Nick and everybody else Baby that's Mama there, crew. Baby Mama Crew, to calm down and don't ever, ever go after a female when it's not her fault. Because who knows what she has been being told compared to what I've been told. And so that's why I want to make sure that we hit. So we that's what everybody needs to make sure that they know. So Gabby, if you hear, I don't even know how to check. I want to uh, per, I want to apologize, and so if you see this, and I just want to personally apologize to you. I want to apologize to Sierra too, because as a friend, you would hate to see somebody getting called that. And we all know he likes everybody' pictures, so that has nothing to do with you. I just don't like the fact that my supporters came after you, and they ne they were accusing, they were assuming, just yeah. like we all were. And I just wanted to apologize because, like I said, we we know we hearing this stuff. And we don't, we don't really know. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I just want y'all to, as females, y'all have, we have got to stay positive. If we keep coming after these other females, we're not going to get nowhere in life because we, me, Gabby having a bad vacation because people in her comments going off and Sierra, they going off on y'all, Gabby from CNG, people going off on her and people going, you know what I'm saying? People going, you know, like what's going on with me and Chris and Trey is still on vacation. They still yeah, on the beach. Fine, you know? And so as Why a female, we got to stay mean? together. Mm -hmm. We get all these comments and people going in on us, and they still vacation and nowhere to be found. You know? And so as a as a female, I'm reaching out to females. I'm telling other females that have been in this position to make it right because you know, it's going gonna, it's gonna to tear you up that you're sitting there stressing over something. Ooh. I'm, I'm good. good. I'm good. You I just, you I, no, I'm good. If you say that I am, I'm good. Uh, I'm good. I know it deeper. Like, we have to stay together and if we do not stay together we are going to fail because y'all missing a big picture we all these females we all going we all having these problems and he's he's on vacation <laughs> and people are people are missing the big picture of when Trey drops his video whenever he does and whatever he says I want to make sure that the truth and everything is told Trey told me 3 days ago before they hit Miami we talked in the car and he said, oh, this was all business. He said, he said, this is all business. And he tried to indicate that he told me the whole time. But if you have somebody that you trust, and I don't know who your trust person is, but if somebody come to you and they telling you, my trust person is my mom. Mine too. Trey was going to my mom and telling her, hey, like, man, I have feelings for your daughter on a business and a personal side. You see what I'm saying? And I'm and I'm trusting my mom. And my mom's telling me, oh, my God, baby, put your guard down. Put your guard down. Just like everybody else in the comments, don't push away a good person because you hitting, you hitting my mom with the spiritual. Oh, I'm all about God. You hitting my mom with uh, uh, all these, you know what I'm saying, all these little, like, I care about her. I love her vibe. I respect her as a mom. I love her decisions and how she moving with Daniel. All of this is being told in front of me and to my mom. And my mom is telling me, baby, let your guard down. You trust your mom. You trust your go-to person. Now, mine is just my mom. So that's who I'm trusting. And so I'm letting my guard down. But then I'm telling, I'm looking, I'm like, no, some stuff is not adding up. And if you ever kept track of my tweets, you could tell some stuff wasn't right. You see what I'm saying? And that's how I feel. And yeah. so you can, you can go and say, oh, I said from the get-go. But you could have came in and said, oh, it was business. But no, not once did you ever say that the fake personal side was, was what that was. And a lot of people making tweets like, well, you can't fake the whole washing her hair. And you can't fake holding her hand in the looks. That's what I'm saying. How can you fake that? He played so with everybody good. in the house. Everybody emotional was just everywhere. He played how, can, you can, how can you fake that? And I'm not saying, like, a, how can you... F I'm saying that, like, somebody has to be so good at a certain way to actually look me in my face and make me melt inside because the way they looking and how they acting off and on camera. And so everybody, like, how can you fake that? It had to be something real. And I feel like it may have been, but I feel like I was getting stronger feelings. It was really like, oh, dang, I'm playing with her emotions too much. Let me, let me back it up. And so when I start backing up and I'm like, okay, well, I don't really know if I want to just do, I'm let me back up a video. Maybe I don't need to do as much because I'm like, I need to figure out what's going on. And anybody that knows me, my tweets have spoke for me. I hate that we're moving in snow lately. Yeah, it's like we lagging. Dang it. It's too many people up here. That's what happened? Yeah, you're, you're top five. 
But I think you, if you talk, I think they still can see you normally. Oh, well, yeah, it's close. Uh, mm-hmm. Okay, so you're picking But I, everything, when Trey drops his video, if he drops his video, whatever he mm-hmm. says, I hope he tells the truth. The truth. 100% the truth. Y'all know what I'm No, I'm trying to, everybody, let's love each other. And it's talking about we lagging. No, oh, let me go see. I'm about to laugh about it, but let me see if you can see. Or the highest one? Or the highest one? It don't say nothing bad. Well, they still need to hear what I say. The whole video is breaking up so bad. You want to start over? Or I'm in this live. I'm gonna come right back because y'all know what I'm saying. Stop y'all sing, sing recordings. Let me come back and hit you with the real facts because I got a whole bit more. Oops. I'm back. You're probably going to too many people like like and For CNG, as as a friend, I feel like I should have like I'm I'm happy. I'm, I want to let y'all know that I have a problem with y'all. I'm sorry, like you have to laugh because God probably just telling me like you know. But I'm trying to tell everybody what's going on. When Trey drops his video, if he drops a video, I want to make sure he tells the truth. He told me off camera, on camera that there was real film there. And then three days ago, before he went to um, before he went to Miami, he said, "Oh, hold on, it was business." If you you're looking like, wait, what? So why did you lie throughout our whole time talking, saying that oh, business and personal? Because to be real, I love, I like. I The paparazzi y'all seen with King, all of those were business. But here I am, my heart melts. We look y'all happy. It's it's the same. Oh my God! Oh my God. I don't know what to do because they need to hear. They say King. I just I have so much to say. You want to go laugh from somebody else? Yeah. Give me somebody. Give me somebody. It looks like everybody back. Moral of the story, when Trey dropped his video tonight, man, I just want to make sure he tell the truth. Three days ago, he told me that the whole time it's been business. Throughout the whole time we was doing videos, personal and business-wise, he was telling me that there were feelings there. I was saying there was feelings there because I was getting feelings. Mind you, I don't like to put my guard down. Aries a thug. I'm a thug. And I done said that multiple times. I'm a thug. And so I'm 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 trying to tell everybody like I'm a thug. And this person is looking at me and they're telling me, trust me. Trust me. They're going to the person I trust, which is my mom. Trust me. Everybody in the house looking like, oh my goodness, like, ooh, team Aerie, team Trey. But come to find out, team team Trey wasn't team Aerie. But Aerie was team Trey this whole time. That's how I was feeling. And so I'm a female, and I'm sitting here, and I I just want him to, you know what I'm saying, when he says what he has to say to tell the truth, that he didn't tell me that this whole time has been business until three days ago before he left for Miami. Okay? And so that's what everybody needs to know. Second of all, I don't appreciate nobody going after C&G because of Trey. When he had, when, like I said, he, he, he not defending the girl or nothing like that because they, they used, they went live before. 
we seen that but what i'm saying i have no problem with her because he's single she's a grown woman i just don't like the fact that everybody's going after her calling her out her name and going against her character because i've met the girls i hung out with them for a couple of days i have their numbers and stuff like that and i just feel like if that's the case then people need to ex like like just accept the fact that it just <laughs> Just, just accept it. Let me look. Let me make sure I hit everything. Because I need y'all to know what is going on. Is they here? Because I need to talk to them. So go get them. Go, go get tell them. C&G. Go tell C&G. I said hi. And that I want to apologize. Because it's it's not fair. It's not fair that people is going after them. And as a friend, I'm looking like, oh my goodness. But... If you was a friend, like I wouldn't have to even yeah, look at you. Yeah, like I wouldn't supposed, even. I wouldn't even have watching. to. You must say he's watching. I don't know. I wouldn't even have to worry about the fact that you would talk to him, and y'all say and y'all say that y'all have not seen him. Y'all say y'all have not talked to him. Y'all say y'all have y'all have no type of communication at all. And I'm trusting y'all, and that has nothing to do with me also. But this is what y'all are saying. But as a female, if I fit, I'm going to investigate. That's like if you break up with somebody, you're like, hold on. Boom, boom, boom. And so as a woman, I didn't want to go on live and make tweets about them. I called her as a woman, and I said, hey, like, are you with Chris and Trey? Like, what's going on? And she said no. And so I just want, I just want everybody to know the truth. Everybody, everybody know the situation and why Daniel doesn't come to the house as much. He's good. Everybody know that um, that we, me and Trey, before they moved to Houston, like we was just going live with each other. But before we started doing videos on each other's channel, that me and him were moving like, oh, like, oh, my goodness, I like being around you. Oh, my goodness, everybody else loves us being around each other, too. And that we were doing these videos. It could have been anybody I was doing these videos with. And then you got him kind of saying like, oh, well, you know, it was just, this was such a business move. And I thought that these two people were my friends. And I'm not talking about CNG. I thought that these two people who are living in the house were my friend. Was you know what I'm saying was my friend, and that's not that's not the case. What I do? I don't know. You scared me. No, because I kept touching you like this. Yeah. Oh, no, that was so yeah, I just want to make sure everybody. I just want everybody to get the your comments under uh, Gabby.